Hello, my name is Bill Lowey, and uh, I'm a new dealer at Gannon's uh, Arts and Antiques. And um, my specialty and passion for the last 25 years has been railroad, and whether it's uh, Railroadiana or toy trains. Uh, uh, that's what I've collected, that's what I've bought, sold, traded over the last 25 years. Um, we enjoy coming to Florida, so I thought I would expand. Uh, some of my interest uh, in Florida. I have places in uh, Lancaster County and lots more stuff too. Uh, a couple of the special things I have here are the Marks Army Train which uh, is a pre-war army train as well as a post-war army train. All of those are original. Um, I also have the uh, American Flyer Washington set with the Cannon uh, flat car. Um, and down here we have a Mickey Mouse uh, uh, Disney Meteor Express along with a, a very unusual, I'll say unique because it's the unique lines that made them. It's a unique circus train um, as well as other um, items of Lionel and American Flyer interest. There's also another Mark Seaboard train in the background here. Down below there are some really interesting builder's plates. Um, they're very heavy. <laughs> Uh, they are from the Canadian Pacific Railway, and on the back of each builder's plate is the actual locomotive that it came off of. Um, these are highly collectible for individuals. Uh, some steam whistles, um, some signage. Uh, we have a Pennsylvania Railroad uh, builder's plate from a P5, which was a box, car, box cab electric, looks like a GG1. Uh, again, with all the information and history on the back. And there's another case full of Railroadiana as well. Well, this uh, is the second showcase, and uh, it's almost in exclusively Railroadiana. And the variety is pretty extensive, including lots of uh, dining car uh, pieces that uh, came from the Union Pacific, New York Central, Chesapeake and Ohio, the Pennsylvania, Santa Fe, the Canadian Pacific. Uh, there are more lanterns up here, as you saw in the previous uh, uh, showcase. Lots of glassware, uh, obviously from Pennsylvania, uh, that's where I've been located and that's sort of my passion. A lot of it's Pennsylvania Railroad, but you'll see Baltimore and Ohio, Illinois Central, uh, some Southern, some Chesapeake and Ohio, and onward. There's a couple of uh, hats here, a New York Central uh, conductor's hat, the Chesapeake and Ohio brakeman's hat. There's some interesting Stanley uh, thermos pieces that are marked uh, for uh, Pennsylvania Railroad, for the Pullman, the New York Central. There are butter pads. There are, there are railroad locks, some of them with keys, and these are all marked. Lots of playing cards. Uh, a few books. Uh, there's some Pullman items down here, a Pullman blanket. There's a Florida East Coast Railway uh, uh, pad uh, with uh, the markings on it. There's some cuspidors. Uh, have very interesting pieces, as well as lots of china at the bottom. And of course, if you are interested in any items, you can always contact uh, us, and uh, I may have it. I may have it up north, uh, sitting in my places there, or I have access to finding it for you.